Hi, I'm Mark Brown from EditorsKeys.com and as you know, we like to make the editing process faster and easier than ever before. So today I'm going to give you a quick sneak peek on a new controller we're working on for Leap Motion. Our new application allows you to use Final Cut Pro, Pro Tools, Cubase and other video or audio editing programs just with the motion of your hand in midair. Let me show you exactly how it works. The first thing you'll need is the Editor's Keys app and a Leap Motion controller. Once plugged in, you're good to go. There'll be over 50 gestures in the final release, however today I'll show you just a few. First is zoom. Put five fingers in front of you and pull up to zoom in. This gives you quick control over your timeline. To zoom out, using five fingers, simply push down and watch your timeline shrink. Next is the play and pause gesture. If you're working on your project and want to start previewing your timeline, simply use a one finger gesture and tap down. This gets your playhead started. If you're already watching your footage and want to pause to make a quick edit, tap down again and the playhead will stop. A quick and easy gesture to help you stay focused on your video. So you want to cut some of your footage. Well, a two finger and slice down gesture will activate the blade tool. This makes a cut at your playhead or point of edit. Scrubbing is one of the most fun gestures. Remember those old school style video jog shuttles? Well now you can simply use your finger as a virtual jog shuttle. Simply spin your finger in a clockwise or counterclockwise motion to move backwards or forwards through your footage. The best part is the motion gets faster or slower depending on the speed of your finger. Pinch to zoom works exactly the same way as your iPhone, but without ever having to touch your screen. We're hoping once again we can revolutionise the way people edit. I hope you've enjoyed this quick preview and please leave your comments below with any features you'd like to see included in the final app. You can keep up to date on this project at editorskeys.com or follow us on Twitter using the at handle editorskeys.